there are people screaming off in the distance. And tonight, for the very first time ever, the Grim Life Collective is here at Knott's Berry Farm. Well, it's nighttime and it's Halloween, which means it's Knott's Scary Farm. You ready for this? I'm ready. We're so excited. We have front of the line access. We're here all night. They're open at one o'clock in the morning and we are just gonna get scared. And hopefully you guys will get scared too. Happy Halloween. Boo! Not entirely sure where we are going, but we are going deep into the fog. Ew. There are creepy cowboys and what have you not everywhere. This is something else, baby ghoul. And your hair is glowing. You can, basically, we, we can't see anything. We're just like walking into pitch fogness. And this place isn't part of the haunt. But gosh darn it, I want to eat there. It's looking a little extra spooky, this restaurant. Kind of hard to navigate this, but it's a lot of fun. There's somebody over here with a light. Digging the atmosphere here. <laughs> I love just standing here in the fog and watching people get scared and screaming. It's the best. Oh, I have been trying to find you all night and you are looking absolutely gorgeous and beautiful and spooky. Oh my God. And Jessica has found the fog. This is her favorite part of all spooky I'm places. You're trying to hug the fog? I don't know if you can. It's gone. Oh, no, there it comes back. <laughs> She's just so spooky. Smell my breath. Smell your breath? Oh god, that's that's pretty foul. Yeah. Hey, I want chicken. You, chicken. Keep you know, at this point of the night, I don't really care if we ride any of the rides here. Just walking around Calico Ghost Town. Look at this. Now, if you know anything about the Grim Life Collective and Jessica, Jessica, just right here, she is obsessed with pumpkins. What do you think, baby ghoul? I like that these are here. And yeah. They're massive. All right, first house of the night. It's a little ditty that I'm really excited about. It's called Waxworks. Look at this facade. Oh my God. All right. Oh, this is something else. Oh, 
right, there's people jumping out all over the place. I ran into a chain. Oh, oh, oh. oh god, all right, all right, all right, that was cool. All right, this is messed up. What did you think of Waxworks? That was probably the most disturbing thing I've ever seen in a haunted attraction in my life. <laughs> it's nightmare fuel for sure. It was cool. He you said know, it stinks, it, right? It, it has a very... Um, distinctive smell like a very yeah like burn bleh. which i guess you would expect bleh. because they're melting people in plastic and wax and um the haunts here are big yeah. first house of the night and i just love that there's roller coasters and people are screaming yeah what was really cool about it and i'm hoping that all the rest are going to be like this it was so in depth like Very everywhere you walked. Don't it was forget just... to look up. Yeah, oh There's God. a lot of big pieces, a lot of like really intricate. There's detail everywhere here. You ready for the next house? Oh yeah. All right, let's go continue to get scared. It is a sanitarium after all. All the way through guys, fill in all the available space, please. All right, so far this is pretty intense. I don't really know where we're going. It's so dark. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, it's the devil's trap on the floor. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right. What on earth? Is this? Oh God! All right, this just got really disturbing. the scares properly or maybe it was just too dark yeah it felt a little short for me it was definitely a lot shorter than, than wax works we've done yeah so far. yeah but um what tricks they had are really cool now i guess this is a fan favorite again this is our very first time being here at not scary farm it's and they the said this is the last so year far, yeah. yeah and uh it effect wise mm -hmm. it had a lot of special effects which was really <laughs> cool not scary farm when you go into when you go into most haunted places everything's in front of you yeah a lot of times you miss it so it's behind you yeah here at least they're above you they're yeah. below you i mean when you walk into a maze here it feels like it's just you're you're surrounded and you know what i think that's how a haunt should be <laughs> I love the dripping sounds, that's for sure.
so we're going into some sort of whale's mouth or something. What is this? Oh, okay. All right, that got me, that got me. Right? It smells amazing in here. Oh god, this is beautiful. Oh my word. Oh god. Alright, so they're below us. Oh! All right, all right, all right. Oh my word. Oh. God. What is that? All right, there's somebody there. It's a giant octopus. Oh, God. All right, they're behind me. Oh. Oh, jeez, Louise. Okay, all right. <laughs> Alright, I am officially shaken. Ah, ah! There's a giant shark! Out of the houses that we've seen so far, this one here was the most in-depth. In-depth! I said in-depth! I made a Halloween spooky funny. Do you have a blast? Tell us, what was your favorite thing about this maze? <laughs> Pretty much everything. Uh, everything! Oh my god! Like, the mermaids, uh, the, the octopus, the ship. The ship! I'm like, uh, okay, let me compose myself. They caught me off guard a few different times. I actually screamed. I jumped. Did you hear me screaming, I love you, behind you? <laughs> I said it like, I screamed it at like five different people. I, I screamed it at the shark, I screamed it at the octopus, the I screamed shark. it at the, the mermaids, the guy with the shark head. Um, I just, uh, yeah. I screamed I love you at like everybody I passed by in the maze. That maze was in depth. Oh, all right. On to the next one. This is my this is my happy clap. All right. Here we go into dark entities. Attention. Please review access rules regarding what items are not allowed. Access results the right channel
right, baby girl, what did you think of Dark Entities? It had a very, um, especially in the beginning, it really felt like Event Horizon there for a minute. Um, maybe in toward the middle, a little alien even, and then just like contaminated everything at the end, like mishmash monsters and uh, a little bit of slither actually, like a slither, a slither in space. Yeah. <laughs> set up like an old school movie theater or an old dark ride in fact it is called dark ride castle of chaos <laughs> Just got out of Dark Ride, which probably has to be one of my favorites because it kind of feels like you're walking the tracks of an old school Dark Ride. It kind of reminds me of the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk. Jessica's over there, she found some carnival games. You see what I mean? She's over there, she's found these really cute looking skeleton. I'm not entirely sure what they are. Let's go see what she's doing. 
So she was over here eyeing these things up. Oh. These things called squish mellows. This Look how one. freaking cute they are. So you're saying each one has their own name? Yeah. yeah. And this one's name is Marvin. And they have their own description to their little bio. Oh so man. Marvin, he's the life of the party apparently. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's cool. That one over there's got a unicorn horn, baby girl. You see it? Look at that thing. Skelana? Ah, that like skeleton, but yeah. Skelana. Yeah. That's cute. <laughs> oh my word. Looks like Jessica's made a friend oh of some God. sort. Yeah. Creepy, creepy. Yeah. I'm not creepy. Yeah. I'm a clown. There's a difference. <laughs> <laughs> now we've heard nothing but good things about this house. It's called Messimer. Yes. All right, spooky, spooky. Oh man, I'm excited for it. Oh my word. trippiest house maze that we've been in tonight. I'm going to say the most mind bending. I've never been in a maze like that. Most of these places here tonight, they're not scary to me. It's more like no. it's beautiful. Like it's trippy. It's like you're going inside this crazy environment. Did you get scared at all in there? No, I got followed a little. <laughs> um, it's, um, how do you say? It's like visually distorting, so you feel like, you know, the floor is like this, but it's not. And then I have things that move while things are spinning. 
it's like um, a hypnotic clown show. What did you think of, you know, usually I'm still dizzy. they have that tunnel bridge, right? <laughs> this one here was square, it wasn't circle. It was square, but it still had the same effect because the bridge itself moved and then the square moved and you're like, huh? <laughs> Pumpkin eater! How I This is intense. Look at these things. Oh my word. Oh my God. go this way. It's hard to tell. All right, there's creepy people in the dark. Oh, jeez. Oh, my word. Oh, God. There's pumpkin seeds. This is amazing. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. There's people around every corner. Oh man. All right, this is trippy. Oh god, okay, oh god, okay. I'm gonna get hit, I got, I got hit by a, a corpse. This is intense. Okay, okay. baby girl the house that i was so excited that you were going to see was pumpkin eater what did you think of it i got to go inside a pumpkin and i saw a pumpkin king i saw two and uh it was like a pumpkin wonderland like man it was cool there was a lot of cool gore to it um there's so much small detail to see that I wish they didn't like keep rushing you through it because I wanted them to keep stop and pointing things out and every time I saw something cool you probably heard me behind going, oh my god! So yeah, I loved it. It was really dark. It, yeah, well, I mean it was, but you could see it with your eye. 
But we can well. go through as many times as we want. We can keep going through that house all night long. I'm gonna check out the different scare zone here and hopefully see some monsters in the fog. It's looking pretty promising. Well, at least the fog is. Oh man. All right, we need a smoke machine, baby ghoul. We need a smoke machine as if our life depended on it. And then here, all right, she's gone. All right, I have officially lost Jessica at Not Scary Farm. All right, that's just creepy as hell. That is creepy as hell. <laughs> creepy as hell, my friend, creepy as hell. <laughs> Wait, are you trying to scare the scare actors? I think it's supposed to be the other way around. But of course you would do something like that. All right, baby girl. Our first night ever at Knott's Berry Farm. Our first night ever at Not Scary Farm. Of what, both, yeah. Of both. Yes. Definitely gonna be getting season passes to this place because I wanna yeah. keep coming back. And I wish that we we're leaving in the month of October for the East Coast. I wish we were still here because I'd come here multiple nights. This was so much fun. What did you think of Not Scary Farm? Not Scary Farm, you'll say? <laughs> uh, listen, okay, so before coming here, we heard a lot of people's opinions. Mm -hmm. So walking in here, I'm not gonna lie, I had low expectations, I did. And they were freaking shot out of the water. And I'm not saying like, oh, it was better than I expected. It was freaking phenomenal. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. We absolutely love Disney and we love Universal. But here in Southern California, the place to be for Halloween is right here. With that being said, from Not Scary Farm, happy Halloween. Man. It's coming my way wherever I go Hard luck is that it stays Good luck never stays a day A bad luck's always coming my way